All right, so this person here, Falesa, on Maker World, says that he has the last scraper you will ever need. Scraper for what? Scraper for print for your print bed, scraping things off your print bed for your 3D printer. Because having a 3D printer means that you need to find tools to fix the problems created by your 3D printer. And you do that by using your 3D printer. It's like the fat bastard cycle. Except instead of being fat and depressed, you buy something and you have problems because of what you buy. So you keep making things to fix those problems with the thing you bought. So he says it is the last scraper you'll ever need. I'm going to see if that is true. So I print it off a red one. So let's see if this truly is the last scraper that we ever need. I'm going to do this by printing a bed calibration test which is just a single layer of nine squares and some lines connecting them. I'm going to see how well this thing actually scrapes off this uh, PE, this textured PEI plate. More to come. All right, the best scraper, the last scraper you'll ever need. For the record, here's what I had before. I believe this is the one that came with the Neptune 4. This is what we printed off. The last scraper you ever need. Definitely unique. This is just a bed calibration. Scrape, 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 scrape. Scrape, 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 scrape. Well, look at that. Well, not, oh, there we go. I guess as long as it breaks it free a little bit, but, Maybe my adhesion is a little too good. Because this is not scraping anything off. But let's try the one that I got with the printer. I'm sorry, buddy. But whoever you are, the one that I got with the printer does work a little better. Regardless, I'd say maybe my offset's a little too much and things are sticking too much to the printer. Either way, uh, this video was useless, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway.